Welcome to the awesome shoutout 1.4 video release. Now is the time, finally. I know it took a long time. Apologies, I, I was kind of busy. By now, you should be able to obtain it both using the one click installer here in the description or following the instructions that you, you're gonna see later on the video. If you are already familiar with the shout out, you can jump to this moment in the video and you will be able to get a quick summary along with an example of everything that, that just changed. And, and also it's important to know that this video was recorded on a live stream. That's why you will see a lot of cuts in it. I had to edit it all out because I made it in English and Spanish at the same time. So yeah, that may have not been the brightest idea. But I think I made it work. If you think it's good or not, please comments there in the comment section. Like, dislike if you didn't like it or, or, or if, if you really, really like it, consider subscribing. For those who don't know what the awesome shout out is, it's a widget that is running on the Stream Elements platform and it allows you to place or to show images and video as well as playing sound. But the idea is that you use it to shout out people. All right, now, how does it work? Very simple. So you, in the widget, you can configure a command that is gonna be waiting to, to read from chat. Now, once you or your moderators write that command, then the awesome shout out is gonna trigger, depending on several things. I'm gonna show you how it works. Now, the preview, the preview of how it will work, where, well, I have this one, let's say, and I have, I just have the sound, I have just the, uh, a uh, text in the bottom and a text in the lower parts and also for all the changes or for the people that already know the awesome shout out i'm gonna be also explaining all the changes that we made during during this uh, last version all right uh, by the way i want to to clarify this is not a sponsor a sponsor stream i like stream elements I, I use it because it works and i like developing stuff for for that platform because it is it is very easy to do it and it's uh, very intuitive for me you can also use this platform on Streamlabs OBS. It is not a, a limitation. Facebook Gaming, it, it, is, it is supported now in this new version of the awesome shout out. YouTube is not supported at all. It doesn't work for now. And which we have the uh, Mixer. For Mixer, I haven't done the test, but in theory, it should work. I still don't support it yet. Next version is gonna have the support for that. When you join Stream Elements and you, in this case, you log in with your Twitch account, you're gonna see a, a few options on the left. For these purposes, we are gonna focus in two options. We're gonna uh, we're gonna focus on the themes gallery and my overlays. Now, in your overlays, if this is the first time that you are using Stream Elements, you're not gonna have anything here. You're gonna have this part empty. Here, you can actually get themes and these themes are gonna give you uh, a lot of things but that's not what we are interested in right now and, and these things can be a full overlay package for you and these are completely free and once you already have them then you can modify it but for now what we are interested in is widgets now each widget is a little program that is going to do something and from here you can find all the you know, the most Let's say that the most popular widgets that have been done by the community in this case my widget is gonna is gonna be here once you find the one that you want in this case the awesome shout out you can click on create and it's gonna ask you for a name or you or you can copy the contents of the widget or that overlay to another existing overlay in my case i'm gonna create a new one now that uh, that link that we just saw it's important but we can get it from inside the overlay itself the one that we just created as 1.4 it's here so this rectangle up here this is the widget when you once you click on the in this rectangle you're gonna see that it turns a, a little bit uh, bolder and you're gonna see a black dot over here right now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna explain how it works and then i'm gonna uh, share how to take it to your obs whether it's obs studio obs uh, with obs live from stream elements or uh, streamlabs obs let's uh, let's just click on this and once you click on it on the left you're gonna see a lot of options uh, right, right here on the left on the layers we're gonna see every single object that we have in this overlay we only have two objects this label and then the awesome shout out widget itself so let's just minimize let's just minimize this so now what i'm gonna do is we're gonna go field by field and i'm gonna be explaining what changed from the previous version all right we have the general configuration now the first thing that you're gonna see if you already know the awesome shout out is that everything is grouped into into well classifications of fields now we have the general configuration 
now and then we have the top text we have the bottom text then we have something new we have something that is called the vip users now this is nothing this is just to separate everything and then we're going to have the vip list the first thing general configuration first this is going to ask you how long is the notification going to be on a screen so this thing is gonna is gonna indicate whenever somebody writes exclamation mark so in chat once that command is uh, triggered there has to be a word so basically what i'm saying is when someone writes exclamation mark so and the name of someone we can say don't do anything i'm gonna i'm gonna place this video as an example we can put an image or a video and also we can decide to play a sound file so the idea is that we can then choose if the video is made smaller by changing the size then we can choose if we want the video to go up or down with the vertical position and then we can do the same with the image so let's see what happens here yes okay yes so we also have the sound we have the image all of the everything that you just saw was the, the general configuration now let's go to the top text and lower text configuration what color do you want what color do you want blue red purple green i mean it can be just a, a dark red or anything so when the text comes in and out it has an animation and actually the animation we're going to change the animation we can flip we can flash let's you, let's do flash so let's just choose this rotate up rotate out up and left there are a lot of uh, of font types and you can go to fonts.google.com and that's where you can see all the fonts that you can select in my in my awesome shot out now that you can play with the size of the image and the per and the position uh, or or the video you can also select the height of the text now you can play with the sizes and the and the text uh, height and all what if we want the name of the person in the text i added something new before the name will be added automatically and you couldn't change it for example right now we have hi my friend what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna use a, a keyword to place the keyword called username this is a keyword in the text that i included so everywhere that you place username in the text is going to be replaced by the name of the person that you are shouting out for example aquí digo username hola coma como vas all right so it's it's a username and then hola como vas which means hey how you doing yes and dale yes. mire so did you see the name of the person is going to appear over there you can change the text you can change the color you can change the animation you can change the uh how fast the animations are going to be the size of the text and the height and you can do the same for the top and the bottom so all the options are exactly the same now this is where the important part comes in this is where the real change is coming to the awesome shout out 1.4 before and before you have to come here to the code and then start modifying text and things here and you the important part is that you don't have to see any code at all now you don't care about that the point is that you can do a special shout outs for certain people called the vip here this vip is only a separator and then we have the vip list if we come to the vip one it's it's gonna ask a name then it's gonna ask a top text and then it's gonna ask a lower text you can have a default behavior for everyone that is not on the vip and then for every person in the vip you can have a different behavior very important by the way you have to place the names all in lowercase here otherwise it's not gonna work in chat you can put it any way you want in the previous version you had to go to the code and change things manually to add more people now the new thing is that now you have a vip list in a big summary basically we have a general configuration now we have the, the duration for the text and the images we have the command what command is going to be catching uh, or is going to be triggering everything now we have a vip list where we can include a name an image and or a video or a sound and we can play with the size and the height so let's uh, let's just play with, with this a little bit so let's choose bill beto and then we're going to place our new friend and then we're going to place here username which is is going to be well his his name username welcome and that's going to be the text for this specific user for bilbeto después vamos a ponerle vamos a poner una imagen so this is going to be the hype image and from here okay now we have the the, the song and now we're going to do a shout out for bilbeto vamos a hacer el shout out para bilbeto oh it did work now the image is a bit large don't you think the image is a poco grande so we're gonna, let's make the image a little bit slower a little bit uh, smaller so here you have the image and then you have a slider for the size ahora aquí tienen tienen la imagen y también pueden cambiar el tamaño vamos a hacerlo un poco más pequeña 40 
Y además de eso, el texto, also the text is a bit lower, don't you think? So let's, let's increase the, the height of the text. General top text, let's do it again. Now that I fixed the size of the image and that I moved the... I move the uh, text, let's see, let's see, oh, nice, now, the image is a bit high, la imagen está un poco alta, no, now, let's move, now, careful with the, careful with the sound, we don't want any copyright in YouTube side, all right, so, what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna take the image, the vertical position, I'm gonna, I'm gonna increase it, for the image, that means that it's gonna be pushed down, so let's just put it, maybe, 29%, 29%, And this is the way that it's calculated. Esto es, this is a percentage, 29% of this, but it's not the whole screen. It's 29% of this specific thing. If you want, if you want, you can do this. And let's see what happens. I don't know what's going to happen. There we go. So now the image, the image is 38%. La imagen es, oh, sorry, I, 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 I destroyed that. But now the 40% of the size is related To this, to this rectangle. Do you see it? I mean, do you see it start from here? Start from here. And then it's all the way up there. So, yeah, you can play around with that. In my case, I like I like just having it... I like having it like this. Me gusta tenerlo así. Porque no, no, no me gusta, no me gusta jugar mucho con los tamaños. Me gusta dejarlo de ese modo. How can you take this and put it on your OBS? Very simple. Muy simple. Aquí abajo, a la izquierda, hay un botón que dice Launch. Now, this link, you can copy it. And now you can go to OBS. And now you can go here to OBS. You can come here. You do browser, sorry, browser source. And then here you can paste the link for that. And that's it for the awesome shout out 1.4. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you like it. I hope you it's uh, I hope it's useful for you. And above all, if you want to drop any comment or suggestion, everything is well received. Also, if you want to drop by our Twitch channel, I usually stream every other day. And also I have a Discord and a Twitter, all the links in the description. Or if you have any cool idea for a widget, just let me know. That being said, I am Rene Chiquete. I hope you are having a great time over there. And I'll see you in the next one.